The fact that this is a whole situation involving with Ice Show Speed of him doing a whoopsie daisy, or I should say an oopsie, to the point where it has led to an entire controversy whether or not he should be banned or not banned on YouTube. To give you guys a little bit of context as to the reason why I'm making a video about this, so Ice Show Speed was streaming the Final of Freddy's Ruined DLC on his YouTube channel when he got jump scared by Chica, and then after he got jump scared by Chica, he tends to play a character like a very loony, crazy a maniacal character every time he streams says some pretty risque edgy jokes now when he got jump scared by chica he started thrusting on the camera and his willy was shown on camera now in the sense that i'm trying to keep my innocence from not watching the clip i didn't watch the clip and before this all happened there's this tiktoker going by the name of nfg tommy or tommy nfg he made a tweet saying this eight year olds witnessing i show speedy flashes pp on stream while expecting family friendly FNAF gameplay. When I saw this tweet, I thought it was just an edgy joke, a little ha ha, lol, lamau, dark joke, but when I went on the trending tab on Twitter, there was a hashtag saying I show meat. Basically making a mockery of his username instead of I show speed, it's I show meat because he showed his ding dong on stream. Now Moist Critical made a video talking about the entire situation and he thinks that he probably did this accidentally and he didn't have any intention to do that and he even saw a theory where he did this just to get like a promotion to live stream on kick which is a very crazy theory and a bold claim to make for me i'm gonna give my own two cents i feel like any content creator with at least over 90 iq can understand that you thrusting to the camera after getting jump scared at playing a scary game is the last thing you would want to do and accidentally showing your private parts is the last thing you would want to do while providing content content to your viewers okay now getting scared is a natural feeling i understand that but actual speedy just shows his character a little bit to spice things up when it comes to live streaming scary games and this just went overboard or i should say it just Actually, how do we even have a pun for that? Now, this opened my eyes a little bit where Dexerito posted a report saying that YouTube will purportedly not ban I Show Speed following his flashing incident. And Big Puffer made a tweet saying, there's no way Twitter thought YouTube was actually going to ban Speed, right? Now, here's my take on this, all right? I feel like I Show Speed deserved to get a two guideline strikes following the incident, accidentally showing his schlong on stream while playing Fun of Freddy's Ruin DLC. And to those of you guys that don't know this, if you get two strikes on your channel that means you can't upload you can't live stream you can't post basically you can't do anything on your youtube channel for two weeks which i think uh deserves to be the punishment that actual speed gets and also have the youtube stream deleted now i don't know if the stream is deleted because i don't want to risk my eyes to see it but yeah this entire situation is like the last thing i expect i show speed to do and let alone it's caused an entire controversy to flood not just twitter but on youtube and a whole bunch of commentary channels to talk about it. When Drama Alert made a post saying, I show speed flash his meat on stream in front of 25,000 people on accident, there is a label saying the media has been disabled in response to a report by the copyright owner. And then the act man makes a tweet saying, ha ha ha, I show speed is copyright claiming the clip of him flashing his ding ding to his minor audience. Now, yes, I show speed's audience is mostly kids and kids got influenced by I show speed. And I feel like I show speed should just understand that even though he could be a crazy loony character that he can play while streaming and making youtube videos he has to understand that there's just some things that i don't think he can show on his channel and i also do believe that the parents are to blame to not let their kids watch i show speed and monitor what they're watching on youtube on their phones either on their tablets computers on the playstation on ba basically any console that you're able to watch youtube now it is good news that i show speed fully recovered from this cluster headache that he's been suffering for the past couple of weeks but then after seeing that he came back in the worst way possible just it, it, it like it just shocks you like you, you you really don't believe it until you're now learning about this i don't know if i should speed is gonna make an apology video in the sense that he just copyright claimed a clip of him showing his schlong or his ding ding or his dingling or his willy it's just not looking good like if you're not letting people have the right to give their opinions on your incident you're just fueling the fire at this point but yeah i just wanted to make a quick video talking about this entire situation like it's just crazy that this is something that i speed did and this is the last thing you expect him the least to do.
All right, but that's going to be it for today's video. Hope y'all enjoyed. If you guys did, leave a like, subscribe, comment down below, down by the video. This is Wolf Dog Gray, and I'll see y'all later. See ya.